All right, folks, so today taking a look at the Viper Tech taser and flashlight. You got an internal battery here, you get a charging cable with that. You got an on off switch right here. It's a 350 lumen flashlight. This has a three position button. So your first button is going to be your bright light. Your second button will be a dim light. Now I'm moving it down and back up. Up is going to be a strobe function. Not the brightest light in the world, but yeah, you can illuminate, you know, decently. I think this is more of a taser, less of a flashlight, but you see your different functions. Strobe function's pretty good. And then you got the dim. So that's the dim, strobe function, bright. So bright light, dim light, strobe function. The third position on your button is your taser. That button's going to be here. And uh, that is loud and intimidating. Ooh. We do have on the flashlight part, get it off strobe there. You do have a little dial here, which will widen or narrow your beam, which is pretty cool. The dial feels a little cheap, but the rest of this feels pretty good quality. It does have a non roll. They put some little kind of hex, some little flat spots in here. So it actually doesn't want to roll. It's not going to roll off a table or anything. Pretty bright light. I've had this for a couple years now. Not that I've used it on anybody, but I do believe that's a pretty good way to uh, kind of stop a potential threat before it gets worse or goes to uh, another, another form of self-defense. So less, le less lethal defense here. I keep this by the door so that my wife has that option as well if she needs to uh, intimidate someone or actually use it on somebody. Luckily, we haven't had to do that yet, but we do live in Houston, and Houston is nice and full of crime right now. We don't live in Houston. We live on the outskirts of Houston, but it, it still overflows to the outskirts. I've uh, been pretty impressed with this. They do have a lifetime warranty on these. They say it's a 100,000-hour bulb. Like I said, I've had this for a couple years. I have used it as a flashlight a few times. I have brighter lights, so it's not the first thing I grab, but you know, it does work pretty well. Seems pretty sturdy. Operation's pretty easy once you figure that out. So you just back and forth is your flashlight options. All the way forward is your taser option. So kind of nifty. Good little deterrent maybe you can slip this in a purse or something and with that button back it does come with a soft holster here so this just slides down velcros over the top you got a belt loop it's kind of flimsy so i probably wouldn't do that but to put in a purse or something this would be a good option to keep that you know the button from actuating on its own or getting slid around all right, folks, so that's what I got for you today on the Viper Tech and uh, maybe a good cheap option for less, le less lethal defense. These run about $15 and they, uh, they seem pretty, well, intimidating. I will link this in the description below. I appreciate y'all watching. Y'all stay safe out there. I'll see you next time I make a video.